Hello folks, this is Ketchup, and welcome to the first video of the A10A short guide series, covering the startup, taxi, and takeoff procedures. First, turn on your electric system by right shift and L. Toggle the cockpit lights with L if you're flying in low light conditions. Next, open the rearm refuel menu with right alt and apostrophe. Please note that FC3 planes must have engines fully shut down to rearm refuel. Edit the flare, shaft, gun ammo, all that sorts as desired. The preset loadouts are created prior in the mission editor, which I'll cover in a separate video. Request rearming. Was waiting for the ground crew to finish rearm refuel. Turn on your wingtip navigation lights with right control and L. Then check your wingtips to confirm. Switch on the nose gear light with right alt and L. And cycle between landing, off, or taxi lights. Once the ground crew announced rearm complete, set your throttle to idle and start both engines by pressing right shift and home or start individually with right alt or right control for left or right respectively. Note however that the engines will spool up individually regardless. Close the canopy with right control and C. As the first engine comes to life, we'll set takeoff flaps by right shift and F once. You can also bring up the controls overlay with right control and enter. For those laptop users like me, I suggest using right control plus 1, 2, 3 for starting left, right or both and right alternate to shut down accordingly. Wait until both engines idle out around 60 RPM and the APU shuts down. Begin taxi by throttling up to overcome the inertia and using Z or X for left right rudder. Maintain taxi speed using taxiway reference of 1 to 2 lines passing your cockpit per second. Use wheel brake W when slowing down or making a tight turn. Switch off AI reports with right shift and backslash should you find the AI allied reports too annoying. Stop at the runway hold line once you're there and check for any traffic on both ends, visually and using the F10 map. If clear, take the active on runway and announce it if in multiplayer. Do not use AI ATC. For takeoff, cycle the nose gear light to landing. The A10 carries an ECM jammer pod on the left wing station and AM9s on the right causing an asymmetrical left yaw on takeoff. Trim your rudder twice to the right with right control and X, Z if left trim, to counteract this unbalanced loadout. There's no indication to how much trim you applied, so remember carefully. Once lined up on centerline, hold wheel brake and move to full throttle. Release when ready and apply rudder adjustments to keep centered on runway. As you go faster, the trim will ease the left yaw. Rotate around 130-140 knots, Hold no more than 10 degrees pitch and let the plane lift itself off the runway. Retract gear with G and flaps up with left control and F. Maintain 5 degree climb and turn off the wingtip lights. That is it. Everything you need to know to get your bird up in the air. There's a ton of keybinds mentioned in this video, but don't worry. I've copied all of them down in the description below and some suggestions. In the next video, we'll cover the limited but very useful autopilot, as well as waypoint navigations, so you won't get lost into bloody Russia. Until next time. <coughs> Until next time, good luck, stay safe, and enjoy your flight.